What's up everyone, Dean Ellis from Dartech again, and we are up to our menu items for system links. Now we've used, we've already used uh, one of the system links in our menu structure in the text separator, which is basically what I use as a, uh, a grouping of all my menus, all right? So you can see it there. Um, so what we're gonna do is go on with the next uh, number of links. Um, I've already created a text separator for system links, so we'll use that as our in our file structure, and uh, we'll get stuck into it. So we click on New, uh, Select, and we're down to System Links. So we click on the System Links, and External URL. Well, that's pretty straightforward. It's exactly what it is. Um, I'll go back to where I've already created one. Okay, External URL, that's what comes up in here. Uh, and all you basically do is put a link to the website you want to link to. Okay, um, I've just gone to Weather Zone. It's, it's one I use uh, regularly. Living up in the tropics, you want to keep an eye on the weather, especially this time of year. Our target window. Now you can have it in your parent, which means you'll navigate away from your own website, or you put it in a new window uh, with or without navigation. Okay, so I just choose a new window with navigation. Um, don't worry about template style. I don't think Weather Zone is going to let you. Um, change the style of their website to suit you. Um, it's in the all human menus. The parent item is my system links uh, text separator. Okay, and we leave the rest pretty much as it is. Um, and once we've done that, we hit uh, save and new because I'll put all the links in there before we do it. And the next time we go into will be uh, click new and you'll open up a new menu item, hit select, and system links and menu heading. Now I spoke about this one a little bit before um, in that it does the same job as a text separator. Now I think earlier in earlier versions of Joomla it did a little bit more than that, um, but I'll just pull it up now. So I've got menu heading in there. Um, we can't set the link. Um, we can have a target window um, if you wanted to but honestly I, I don't think it's going to work that well you can change the template style so I've and I've set pretty much everything else the way I've always set it here um, and that's it now if you go into the Joomla help menus this is the screenshot for the menu heading um, so there's really nothing there's not much different to it this is a, this is an, obviously an older version of uh, of Joomla but there's nothing else really that this does differently to our text separator. So when we go into our home page and we go to our menu heading, you, you, there's nothing you can do to it. It becomes, pretty much becomes a, a, a same as a text separator um, that I've been using for my links here. So um, you have a choice. You can either use system links or you can use the menu heading. It looks like the menu heading gives you an underline on it, but it does nothing else for it. So. Um, I guess it's personal preference. I prefer to use the uh, the text separator. That works quite well for me. Um, and that's how that works. So I'm not going too much more into that. Um, so we'll close that. The uh, the last one I'm going to go into is the menu item alias. Now I've got, you click new. Obviously you go into the next page. We've done a heap of these already. Hit select. System links uh, menu item alias. There it is. There. Okay. And the, the 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 good thing about this one is that you can now link to any other menu item from any other menu on your website. So this list here is all of your menu items that you've created through all of your menus. So we have our main menu here. So there's all your menu items in your main menu. Okay. And that's listed across here. That's these ones across here. Okay, um, hidden menus you can put in there. Okay, I use those for uh, for different things in my website, where I where I want the link, I want the URL to that link, but I don't want that to display on our web page. And our vertical menu. So I've I've selected uh, just for the ease of it, I've selected my uh, my home page for the menu item alias. All right, we've done that. I'm not going to do the text separator because I've shown you how to do that already. Uh, hit save and close uh, and then we'll go into our front end and show these to you. So here's the system links here, my text separator. 
the external URL, if we click on the external URL, it opens up a new window and gives you the website that you're after. All well and good. Okay, the menu heading, well, there it is there. You can't do anything with it because there's no features and options that allow you to click on it and do things. And the menu item alias will take you to the home page. So if we click on this, and we're back to our home page. Um, just to show that a little bit better. Okay, we're off our home page. Click on menu item alias and back to our home page. Uh, so that's how those uh, system links work. All uh, pretty straightforward. Um, hope you got something out of it. If you did, hit the like button. Subscribe to my channel. I'm doing uh, Joomla tutorials front to back on many different playlists. Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now. <music>